Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this given quadratic equation by completing the square method. And one more thing, keep in your mind that over here, this symbol is called omega. So this symbol once again is called omega. And omega is the Greek alphabet letter. Just keep in your mind. So now let's go ahead and get started with our solution. First of all, let's look at this given quadratic equation right up here. As we can see that this equation is easily divisible by two across the board. So let me go ahead and divide each and every term by two across the board. And if we do that thing, this two and two is gone. So we end up with omega square minus 3 omega minus 18 equal to 0. And now we are going to solve this given quadratic equation by completing the square method. So the very first step is we are going to move this constant part, this one on the right hand side. We want to make sure that we have only this omega square minus 3 omega only these variable must be on the left hand side the next step is let's look at this middle part over here the coefficient of omega which is negative 3 let's focus only on this one 3 don't worry about this negative sign i am going to put down 3 right up here Let's divide this one by 2. Always divide it by 2, this number, and then we are going to square it. First of all, once again, let me just go over once again. Whatever this number is, 3 divided by 2, and then square it. And whatever this number we got, this one, we are going to add on both sides. So let me just go ahead and write down omega square minus 3 omega plus and here 18 plus. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put down 3 over 2 square on this side and I'm going to put down 3 over 2 square on this side as well. Now let's focus on the left hand side part on this side over this equation. We can write this one as a complete square of omega minus 3 over 2 square and we are using this fact on the right hand side over here a minus b square is always equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square we use this fact over here equals to on the right hand side 18 and then plus 3 over 2 square is going to become 9 over 4 and here I can write 18 as 18 over 1. And now here I have copied down this part over here and let's simplify this thing. Let's go ahead and crisscross. The easy way of simplifying these two, adding these two fraction is cross multiply. 4 times 18 is 72, whatever this plus sign is just right here. And then 9 times 1 is 9 divided by, look at the denominators, these bottom numbers, 1 and 4. Just multiply them out, that become 4 times 1 is 4. So 72 plus 9 is going to give us 81 over 4. So that means this thing becomes simply 81 over Four and on the left hand side we have omega minus 3 over 2 square and now we want to undo this square so we are going to take the square root on these both sides so this square and this square root they undo each other we ended up with omega minus 3 over 2 equals to 
81 divided by 4, the square root is going to become 9 over 2 with a plus or minus sign. And now we are going to move this negative 3 over 2 on the right hand side. So we got omega equal to this negative 3 over 2 become positive 3 over 2 plus or minus 9 over 2. And now we are going to split these two sign positive and negative and I'm going to write down omega equal to 3 over 2 plus 9 over 2 and on the other side omega equal to 3 over 2 minus 9 over 2 since we have the same denominators divided by 2 3 plus 9 equal to 12 divided by 2 equal to 6 so one of the solution omega equal to 6 here we're going to do the same thing our common denominator is 2 3 minus 9 is negative 6 divided by 2 so omega equal to negative 3 thus our solution turns out to be omega equal to negative 3 and omega equal to 6 and that is our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye